Rob the Builder, can he build it? Rob the Builder. No, he can't. Hello there gamers, today we're going to be looking at this Arcade Classics Qbert Buildable Mini Arcade. I want to thank Ryan for giving me this for Christmas. It's one of a couple gifts he gave me, but uh, I'll show you the other ones later in the big old Christmas haul video. But anyway, this is really weird because I'd never ever seen one before. I didn't even know these existed. Anyway, it's kind of like a Lego kit and uh, you put it together and that's what we're going to do. We're going to put this thing together and take a look at it. But first, we're gonna look at the box, cause that's what we do. There's the front of the box. It says, Qbert, buildable mini arcade, 39 pieces for ages eight plus. Hopefully I'll be able to handle it. Left side of the box. It's basically a repeat of what's on the front with a slightly different angle. Right side of the box, getting kind of repetitious. The back of the box, you build it. Hey, I have some French viewers. Come on, how do I pronounce that? I can, I can pronounce vous because uh, that was in my French class. Uh, but since I only took two years of French and that was like a hundred years ago, yeah, my French is slid. Collect them all and there is quite a few of them. I have seen the asteroids and I believe the centipede one was the other one that I saw because he gave those as gifts to some of my friends as well. Hey look, it's the top of the box. Woot. Here's the bottom of the box. Trademark, 2018 Columbia Pictures Industries Incorporated. Manufactured by The Bridge Direct. Haven't heard of them. All rights reserved, blah, blah, blah. There should be something about not eating them, but I don't see anything there. So apparently go ahead and eat them. No, don't eat them. Box opens from the top, thusly. Come on. And it's got a couple tabs, but I don't know if it's going to come out of the tabs. I think I can probably pull this out without going in there. There we go. All right, so pretty high quality. It feels a lot like it feels a lot like Legos. Hmm. Some stickers in there. I'm going to assume there's an instruction booklet, maybe. It did show how to assemble it on the back, though. A very Lego-like in its presentation. I mean, that's not surprising considering the type of blocks we're dealing with here. But a lot better than many of the cheap kits I've seen on YouTube. Hopefully everything's there. Oh, look at here's a little joystick. Oh my. Step one, one. Okay, let's build this base. Fit together nice and tight. They are very Lego-like. Hmm. Step one, two. Mm, gotta get this little piece off there that was stuck. Well, very step-by-step. Step. Which is how it should be. Step one, three. <laughs> yeah, they're supposed to go vertical. Then this guy goes here and there. And there we go. Step one four. All right, don't know why they didn't put this in the last step. There we go. And here. And there. Good. Good. And I believe this is the proper sticker, yep. Okay, the stickers are, they're okay. Uh, they're, they're thick enough, but they stick a little bit. I mean, they're stickers, but they stick a little bit to the card. So I lost a little piece of it there. It's not good. There's gonna be a, a expert at sticking stuff. Who's gonna be like cringing at how I do this. 
Yeah, it's off. Come on. Ugh. Good. Every time I go to pull it up, I actually press it down harder. Okay. Nope. Need it in the middle. Well, I dislike sticker application. Alright, well. Not 100%, but a good solid 80. Step one five. All right. Turn this around, and there should be an O five. There we go. Looks like it's on the right side. Collector's number. All right, and then this sticks to the top of here. Step one six. <laughs> there we go. Bring this guy over here. Attach that side. Pretty sure the next step, I'm just gonna attach this one over here, another one of these. Step one seven. All right, first I'm going to put Qbert on. There's a little Qbert sticker. And he goes right here. There we go. How do I attach this to the bottom or the top? It doesn't make it very clear. So I'll try the bottom. Looks okay. There we go. Next step. Step one eight. It goes like this. Like this. There. And this guy on the front. Close fit there. Very nice. Sticker time. Looks like it's showing the right sticker. Not meaning the correct, I mean the one for the right side. Okay, there we go. Step one nine. There we go. Oops. Way too high up. OK, 
seem a little loose too. Check it out, I had two extra pieces. Really, I double checked in the contents list. These weren't listed there. And there it is, a tiny little Qbert machine. How cool. And there it is next to a Nintendo cartridge. Looks pretty small, doesn't it? Yeah, this is a cool little knickknack and I like it. I don't know what the price is because I got it as a gift. However, if you enjoyed this video, let me know down below. I'll try and track some more down. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in a couple days.